Hey, Kevin, this is Anthony, the individual you spoke to earlier on the phone in regards to um, the free website analysis. Um, I was just sending this over to you, give you some tips on how you guys can improve and possibly drive some more business um, through uh, online traffic. Um, so I want to start out here just with uh, some standard Google statistics. I won't take much of your time. It'll be a five to six minute video. But um, uh, pretty much all searches are performed on Google these days to be approximate 86.86% and that's 5.6 billion searches a day. I'm just providing these stats to let you know the relevance of ranking on Google's websites because when people search for services and the things they need, they're going to Google to do so. Um, I'll talk about these other statistics as we go along in the video. But uh, Google looks for three things when ranking your website. The first is uh, the content that you have on your web page. The second is your citations. And the third is the backlinks that are coming into your website. So per the website you have set up here, uh, I like the little video that you guys have, um, but it, uh, you have a decent... A uh, decent bit of content, but uh, you could definitely use some more. So Google looks for about a thousand to fifteen hundred words per uh, per home page. You want to make sure those words um, have your keywords that you're targeting for your customers um, that have high search volume. That way, um, when they're searching for things, it's directed to your website. So you know you could definitely put in some more information in regards to some more specific keywords for water damage or fire damage or sewage cleanup or storm damage. Um, you have mold re remediation removal down here. I'm not sure if that's something you still do. I don't see it on the page. But um, that also, because that will drive more traffic too. But that's the first tip I have in regards to um, the content on your web page. Next, we'll go into Google. I typed in a keyword that uh, has a decent search volume in Nashville. Water damage Nashville. 90 people are looking for that a month. It doesn't have a very high keyword difficulty, so it wouldn't be too difficult to rank for and drive traffic to your website for that specific word. So uh, the first thing that pops up when you search that word is obviously your ads that companies are paying for. This is how they're trying to grab those customers. Um, and it's not a bad method. You will get some traffic, but per statistics, only 10% of people click, less than 10% of people click on all those paid ads. 94% of all that search traffic goes to your organic search results. And by organic search results, I mean your uh, companies that are based in this map pack and your companies that are based right here in the URLs. So the first thing that you can do to get to your website up into this map pack is to um, provide more citations to directories so Google can scan and see those citations. Um, and by citations, I mean your, uh, it's just a listing of your business name, your phone number, and your address in a directory. It could be a local directory that's online. You can do it on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, um, um, uh, Yellow Pages. All those are directories, and Google gives preference for companies that have more citations to come up into this map pack. Um, but that's another tip that you can take and use to try to get up in this map pack. It is important to be there because 44 to 61% of people are clicking on businesses in that map pack when they're searching for specific services. Um, backlinking also plays a part in this, which I'll talk about next. So the backlinking determines your ranking in regards to the URL. This is your organic search results that people come down to and search for when they're trying to find something because most people just don't like ads. Um, and when I say backlinking, um, the best way to describe it is it's like a popularity contest in Google's eyes. If you have websites that are pointing to your website, then it gives you more authority and helps you climb the rankings in Google's eyes. So these companies for Water Damage Nashville have the most links that are coming into them to help them be at the top of these search results. And you want to be on this first page minimum. I'm not sure if we are or not doesn't look like it just from a quick glance because per the statistics only 4.8% per of people go to the second page and 75% of the people that search for those keywords are clicking on the top three search results. So you want to be on this top three to get the most uh, clicks and get the most uh, clients driven to your site hopefully for conversions. Um, but here is a website that I use to analyze other websites. It's called AREFS. And I punched in your domain here. And as you can see, you have 37 referring domains, but your domain rating is extremely low. So that's probably due to the uh, quality of links that you're getting. They're probably not very great. 
So you want those quality of links to be better to increase your domain rating, which gives you more authority. Um, and it looks like you're also only getting ranked for two organic keywords, and those keywords aren't even things that your customers are looking for. So you'd want to put the content I was explaining uh, the first tip on your page so Google can crawl your page and realize that, that you're providing those services. And it looks like uh, it's saying zero people are going to your web page every month. Um, so that's definitely not good. You definitely want uh, volume going to your web page because that can turn into uh, conversions and client conversions. Um, but um, in regards to that, I'm going to pop over to the person that was uh, populating number one in the search results. And this is um, Restoration 1, and that was for the keyword of Water Damage Nashville. Um, and when you pop up their information here, sorry, it's just loading for a minute, you can see um, they're getting a lot of their power from their main site, but their back page doesn't have too many referring domains. Uh, this could definitely be B. We can go in and copy these domains and get you more authoritative domains and drive traffic to your site. But as you can see, they're getting 104 people to their website every month, which, uh, you know, if that's if only 10% of people decide to uh, call and uh, they land the clients, that's 10 additional customers per month. Um, and that's a low conversion rate. Um, but they have about, there's about 16 organic keywords they're ranking for. And as you can see, Restoration Nashville has 300 people a month searching for that. They're in the number two position, which is giving them a lot of volume. Water Damage Nashville is 90. They're in the number one position. Uh, that gets giving them a lot of volume to their website and all these other ones here. And, you know, I just use water damage as an example. If you do the mold removal and remediation, you can go after those also. 50 and 40 with search volumes there, uh, 70 there. So, you know, and you're not even on the, um, and these guys aren't even ranking for that. So that's something you can swoop in and get pretty easily for additional, uh, additional uh, clients coming in. But um, that's just kind of an overall view on everything. So you can uh, increase the content on your front page to help with the Google crawl and getting the organic keywords populating on your website. You can add citations to help you get in that Google map pack where you're just getting more real estate. And you can get backlinks from quality websites to help boost your domain rating and give you more authority over these websites. That way you're getting more traffic directed to your site. But um, take these free tips and implement them, and hopefully you get some more traffic. And if uh, you feel the need to reach out to me and help in any way, shape, or form, my phone and email will be at the bottom, um, and you can just contact me. But uh, I appreciate your time.